you are going to learn the correct way to deliver chest compressions. High quality CPR is dependent on chest compressions being delivered the right way. The first thing is to know where do you put your hands. I always tell students to find nipple line and use it as a landmark. You want to position your hands at the lower end of the sternum, also known as the breastbone, lower end of the breastbone. You're going to take one hand, I'm right-handed, so I take the palm of my right hand and put it down first at the lower end of the breastbone. Then I take my left hand, non-dominant hand, place over my right hand. Then you want to make sure that your arms are straight. Then give your first compression. You want to compress two inches deep on an adult victim. This is a change from the 2005 guidelines, which said one and a half to two inches. The new American Heart Association 2010 guidelines recommend that the compression be two inches deep. Another important component of high quality chest compressions is that you push fast at a rate of at least 100 compressions a minute. Some people say if you get a really good song in your head, like Staying Alive or Another One Bites the Dust, you can get in a rhythm and that's gonna help make sure that you are going fast enough. So something like a speed of these compressions would be appropriate. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. The third and most important component of high quality chest compressions is allowing for complete chest recoil. What I mean by that is every time you go down and compress the chest, allow your palms to pop all the way back up. This allows you to pump the blood throughout the victim's body more efficiently. So the three important things to remember about high quality chest compressions is one, press deep, two inches of the chest up, two, fast, at least 100 chest compressions a minute, and third, you want to allow for complete chest recoil. This will make sure that your victim is getting the best CPR possible. Thank you.